What's going on YouTube, Bird here, and in today's video, I'm going to be explaining to you how to obtain the rare Nuka-Cola outfits and power armor paint in Fallout 76. But before we get to the video, make sure you smash that like button where the Fallout 76 team can see this, and subscribe for more Fallout 76 content. Let's get into it. Starting off our little scavenger hunt for the Nuka-Cola rewards, we're first going to head over to the Pylon V13. Once you arrive at the Pylon, you can head just north and you'll find a skeleton with a duffel bag next to him on the ground, and here we will have a toolbox key. Once you've grabbed the toolbox key, you're then going to head to this location right here in Watoga. Upon arriving, you'll find yourself a locked toolbox, which we will use our keys on. And here, you'll find a key to Clara's box. After grabbing Clara's keys, you're then going to head over to Sutton to Clara's house, which is located right here on the map. Clara's house itself is this one right here, though it is completely locked up and boarded away so you cannot get into it. But behind her house, she'll have a little doghouse. And inside this doghouse, there is a crate, which you can unlock with Clara's key. And here, we have a Nuka-Cola locker key. After grabbing the Nuka-Cola locker key, you're then going to want to make your way over to the Nuka-Cola plant. Once here, you're going to make your way through the main entrance and follow my path to the second story where you're going to need at least one lockpick to make your way through the door, which is super duper easy. So just follow this way right here into this room. No smoking. Remember, no smoking, please. This is a door you're going to want to lockpick. After lockpicking this, I already killed the guys in here. Sorry about that. You're going to make your way over into this room right here, and this is the testing area. At the very end of the hallway, there is going to be a locker, which upon you can use your Nuka-Cola locker key. Then you have the TNT Dome key, which we can now take. Now that we have the TNT Dome 3 key, we can head over to the Black Mountain Ordnance Works. From here, you're going to find the construction site, which is that thing right here, and you're just going to head east of it. It's kind of the furthest dome out here, I'm pretty sure. But it's coming up here. You see this little pile of rocks? That is your dome. So just run straight up to this little dirt road. It's not going to have a sign on it because the poor sign fell off. But there's your Dome 3. You're going to come in here, and you're going to use your TNT Dome 3 key. And just like that, we found some fantastic stored away Nuka-Cola props. It's amazing. And here you can get your amazing rare Nuka-Cola outfits or the plan for the T-51 Power Armor Nuka-Cola paint. But this is it, guys. If you enjoyed the Fallout 76 content like this and you want to see more, make sure you smash that like button, subscribe for more Fallout 76 content, and guys, I shall see you in the next one. Peace.